Okay, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to capture whatever is on screen and put it into a Word document. This can be useful if you've got like an error message come up on the screen or an ID you want to remember for later. Um, you can save it down as a Word document and keep it for later. Basically, what happens is there's a key on the keyboard called print screen on the top right hand corner. If you have a look, it's in this kind of location here. Now, this key is used for taking an image of the screen and putting it into the uh, memory or clipboard area. So you can then keep it for later and paste it in somewhere else. Some of you will also find on your keyboard a key that says F or F lock up in the right hand corner around this area. Um, in some cases, you may need to press this key before you press print screen and then press it again after you press print screen to um, be able to use these F keys again as normal. Okay, let's get started. So let's say you're browsing the internet and you come up with an error message like this, page cannot be displayed, and you want to show it to your IT guy. Uh, so what you would do is press the print screen button. I'm going to press F lock and press print screen again on my keyboard just to make sure it works. And then you want to load up Microsoft Word. This is the new version of Word. Um, and you want to paste it in. So you can either right click and go down to paste, or you can press the paste button up here, or you can go into the menu, edit, paste in the old version of Word. So I'm just going to right click and go paste. And let's see if that worked. Okay, here we go. We've got the, the screen that I had up earlier, pasted into the Word document. Now we just want to save that Word document down. So you click on the top left, save as, and well, uh, go down to that older version of Word document. And I'll just call it my error message. Okay, now that document has been saved down to the desktop and you can send that along to your IT guy and he'll have a better understanding of the kind of problems you have on your computer. Another thing you could do is uh, paste it into Paint and save it as a JPEG file. So on Windows XP, Paint is under Start Accessories and then Paint. And we want to open that right up and you go Edit and Paste. And you've got the image of the screen in here in Paint. And then you just go File, Save As, and you can save it here as a desktop. I'm just going to go down, save as a JPEG, call it My Error Image. And there we go, saved as a JPEG image. So this can be quite useful if you have error messages come up on your screen or if you just want to keep something that you've seen on the screen for later. I hope that helps you guys, and catch you later. Bye.